I had an interesting comment the other day on this video that's free images for commercial use. As I scroll on down, this is just a public domain video there that I did. Writer Last wrote, I love these images, loads of ideas, but I notice when I download them and put them into Affinity Designer that they're only 72 DPI, and DPI is DOS per inch. And when I change them to 300 DPI in Affinity, the image seems to look worse, not better. Hmm, interesting. So let me see if I can help. Okay, so I'm in Affinity Designer, and you can see here on the top left-hand side, it says 72 DPI. And that's a bit of an issue if you're trying to make this 300 DPI. So for a lot of KDP applications, and that's like Amazon Book Publishing, they want the pictures to be 300 DPI. So we can manually change this to 300 DPI, and I'll show you how to do that. Basically, you go into File, go into Document Setup, and then inside Document Setup, you're going to get to this screen here. And what you're going to do is down here where it says 72, you can change this now to 300. You can even change it to 400 if you want, but I'm just going to use 300 here. And then we're going to click OK. Now you're not going to notice a difference inside the size of it, but you could have changed the size as well. You could go into Document Setup and you could actually change the pixel size in addition to the DPI. But anyway, we're just going to change the DPI here, 300. So we've now got it. So now if I save this, it's going to save this as an Affinity Designer file. That's not what we want. So instead, I'm going to go to File, Export. And when I go to File Export, I now have the option to export as a PNG or a JPEG, a GIF, a TIFF. So I'm going to go to JPEG and it's going to be best quality. And I'm going to click the export button. Now it doesn't ask me what the DPI is on here, but that's okay. We've already established it up in the top left that it's 300 DPI. So I'm going to export the whole document and I'm going to click the export button. Okay, so I'm in Windows Explorer now, and we can see here's my original file, and it's a JPEG file, and it's 1478 by 2022. Here's my revised, and when I hover over it, it's the exact same size in the dimensions. However, if I right-click on the original file, and I go down to Properties, we'll see that in Details, I've got, this one came in at 96 dots per inch, but in Affinity, it read it at 72. This one, though, the revised one, I've manually changed it. And when I click on Properties and I go to Details, we'll see that it's now 300 DPI. So you can change the size and you can change the dots per inch, which is the resolution, right in Affinity Designer. Hope you found that helpful. Nice little walkthrough. I love Affinity Designer. And hopefully you've got those high-quality images cranking out now at 300 DPI.